should take a segue here <laughs> and talk about Jack's outfit. Don't, really quick. don't bring it up, yeah. man. This outfit's great. Can I feel the thing? You're joking. No. She's yeah. actually, Alex is it? laughing over it. It feels so soft. Okay. Guess what? what? It's not mine. It's, oh. This is Graham's clothes. These Jack are- walked in. I'm going to, sorry, Jack, I'm going to embarrass you. <laughs> If you have this shirt here, you could come in and we'll get we'll get Jeanette's <laughs> honest reaction. I won't say anything. I would love to change out of this outfit. Okay, if so, I could put on my shirt. <laughs> do it, do it. So wait, wait. So let, let me no no not yet. Let me explain the situation okay, here. Okay. Get, get your reaction. Let's get the lay of the land. Jack walked in with the shirt. Okay. I'm not going to tell you anything about it. And I said, Jack, I have this shirt that you should wear instead. Okay. Uh, the shirt is mine. And the okay. jacket is mine. Okay. Jack put it on, and we're like, oh, this is awesome. Jack looks really good. Jack is. Self-conscious it's not me, about man. it. It's just not me. What do it's you think weird. of this? What do you I look th- like a fashionista. <laughs> I, I, I said Jack I'm looks not. really good. No, I think this is great. Yeah. These are like rock climbing pants. I, I have yeah. such simple Those taste. are Jack's pants. Those are not my these, pants. Oh, these are your pants. Okay. Yes. Yes. Like, I have such but simple Jack taste. Jack walked in and I said, we we really got to step up the caliber of, of how we're presenting ourselves to guests. It, and it's fine if we're having our buddies like Kevin and Jeremy on. It doesn't matter. Like that, that's so laid back. No. But when, when, but when we have You're a big guests, deal. You're a big deal yeah. to come on. When we have yeah. guests come on here that that we've never met before, I think it's really, is, it's essential that we, we have a great first impression and that we're professional and that we offer guest coffee and that everything's clean. Coffee. Thank you. Yep. Um, so that's why I was like, Jack, I got these shirts. They're a little too big on me. They're a little baggy. Put them on. They looked great. We all agreed unanimously. You look really good in that. You look See, good. For me, this is just weird clothing. I, like it's just not my style. Jack's not it's, used to looking good. So, so I relate to the feeling of like when something's not you. I mean, I'm wearing a white t-shirt for a reason. I feel I feel like I have to wear something where I can be myself. Because if I'm if I'm like a little more elevated or something, I feel like I get more stiff and I can't like. I'm so talk stiff right now. <laughs> I'm so, like this is so tight on me. I can't like look. It doesn't even look at where it goes to. He made me I wear mean, a smart. watch too. He's all yeah. You gotta, <laughs> yeah I was gonna say the watch is great. <laughs> Yes, I, I knew it. No, what he wants good. is for me to turn into him. That's Jack, exactly. I used to have long hair, and every time I would show up, Graham would be like, "Dude, when are you gonna get that cut?" Get I get a, I get a haircut, and I'm like, "Yeah, cut it mid length." They cut it just like Graham's hair, and, and I, it looked and good. I, and it was. I didn't action. know. I, I didn't know longer. he got a haircut. And like you know what Graham said? He's all, "Dude, I love your hair, man. It looks so good, dude." And I it meant it just like that. I meant it. <laughs> I, listen, J- Jack's hair was was. He'd come in, the whole thing was poofing around. We're having good guests on the podcast. Poofing around. Yeah. <laughs> what? Dude, it looks good, man. No, we'd have high caliber guests on the pod <laughs> flying in from around the country. And then Jack would walk in with his hair all like, and it's like, we're not, listen, we're not in college. It's like, we got to, <laughs> we're, we're running a professional pod. We want to grow the pod. We want it. We got to have a, pre- a presentable professional image. I just don't think this looks professional, to be honest. Everything is way too small on me. Even my pants are, like, way too small on me, dude. I can't even Those are my pants. That's your I know, problem. I, I, I know. All right, all right. I'll put on the shirt that I was wearing, because I really do actually want to change out of this. I felt so weird wearing this, dude. I'm not going to lie. But you thought he, but you thought he looked good. Yeah. I look Swedish. It did not. You like, look so good. I, be honest. Okay. Be honest about this. Don't hold back. So, wait, wait st- stand. Stand, Jack. Stand. I ever get a good look at you. This is what I would have worn. Okay. Can watch. you tr- can I see the pants too with it? Yeah. Let's see. Okay. Let, let's get the thoughts on the. I, on, yeah, Jack, yeah, sit down. Jack, sit down. I I want you to. I had some very <laughs> choice words to say about this. Very okay. choice. Very choice. We all have. I actually took a picture to show him. <laughs> like, is it how so ridiculous I look? Like I. I think like, I look sharp. I look dapper. I want you I to look genuine. Yeah, and be be honest because sharp. I think. Constructive criticism is really important. Oh, let me take and this off too. I guarantee whatever you say is not going to be as harsh as what I said. All right. hundred percent. All right. This watch, guess what? Doesn't even work. <laughs> it's not functional. Purely decoration. Yes. Oh, wait. No, um, I, I'm yeah. not going to scoop this right. So I actually like the cut of, like this style of shirt. I don't love the stripes, but I love this style of shirt. Um, oh. My boyfriend actually wears things like this certain times to Zoom meetings. And I'm like, ooh, like yeah. I love it. I think there's a, something very handsome about like a collared, a nice collared shirt. Um, I don't know if like the material is doing it for me. It looks like maybe it's cotton or something. Uh, it's very soft. So you're doing the criticism sandwich. So we we did it. We went in with a nice thing, also, the bad thing, and then you end with a nice thing. I also button them up like all the way. <laughs> and Graham doesn't like you it. button them all the way. Uh, it depends. Does this it, is it not tighter on your neck? Uh, I just like it. Let's see. Okay. You just I mean, I probably wouldn't do this more. one all the way, but I do my other shirts all the way. All right. Graham says I look like a 14-year-old boy. Yeah. I said if you were 13, fine. You could wear the shirt. I also said it's incredibly wrinkled. 
not to wear something like that. And it's just, I, I think it's not a professional, I don't, I don't think it's a mature look. So I would, I would agree that maybe there's something that looks quite youthful about the kind of like pattern and the material. But as for like this, the cut of the shirt, God, I wish I had a picture of there. There are, I think that there, it's possible that there are like collar well. shirt. The fit's good. Yeah, the fit's good. I think it could be a little bit tighter. A little I think tighter. it's too boxy. What? I, think is, it's, I, I thought this was tight. I think the shoulder fits well. Yes. I think like this area is a little loose. Yeah. And same with the sleeves. A little loose. It's a little dad. A little low. It's a little dad. Maybe if they were there. <laughs> Wow. You know what? If you were a thirteen-year-old dad, that shirt is perfect <laughs> for you. Yeah. Okay. Well, how would you describe your style? Uh, I don't think I really have a style, to be honest. I kind of just wear what I think looks good. I think I th everybody has a style. I think yeah. maybe they what? don't think they have a style. But I think everybody has a style. So I guess. Well, I I never dress up. The only time I okay. ever dress up is for occasions like this. Got it. It's not this. I'm wearing pajamas. <laughs> this, is some, gotcha. this is some dressing up, by the way. Gotcha. I told them I want to take them to H&M and we do like a shopping spree. 150 bucks, completely redo your wardrobe.